okay hi to everyone guys today i am going to explaining you how to create our jdbc folder in our eclipse ide guys in our previous video already i explain you how to connect java application with database with five steps code and store slowly i am going to explaining you i am going to explaining you how to create first project folder in our eclipse ide first we'll see that one one by one and after creating project folder and uh, to connect a java application with a, any relational database means either you can add oracle database or mysql database compulsory we need to add a one jar file suppose if you work with oracle database we need to add ojdbc 5 jar or ojdbc 6 jar file to our project folder suppose you are going to work with mysql database so here mysql connector jar we need to add then only then only okay our java application communicate with jdbc api right we'll see one by one sir in our eclipse id guys understand okay already we have a our eclipse id you know already uh, already you guys install in your uh, pc okay simply what you will do double click on our eclipse shortcut and open now i am going to showing you one by one and here critically also i am given here simply what you will do go to eclipse id and there we have a there we have a one folder that is what file menu there, there we have a one one menu the menu is what sir uh, file menu so we'll see one by one you will get more clarity right suppose this is my eclipse id right is a fresh fresh id i am going to open here and what i will do simply go to the file menu here click on new and then you guys select here java project java project and uh, my eclipse id asking you project name so now my project name is what sir jdbc applications jdbc applications cases this is nothing but a my project folder name and after provide this project folder name simply click on next button automatically our eclipse id in this project folder it will create one more folder that is called src right and uh, once you once you will get this one simply click on finish button that's it automatically your project folder will be created and it will ask you do you want to create any module inside the jdbc folder so absolutely not sir so what you will do simply click on don't create right and automatically my project folder will be created right guys and here my my project folder and once you see this one and automatically some jre system library uh, folder will be came okay next one is one src is came until i am not yet added i am not yet added my my what ojdbc 6 or ojdbc 5 jar right and slowly we can add that jar simply what i am doing already that jar i saved in my this pc this pc and uh, c drive guys and uh, here i have a one folder the folder is what a lib folder right and he here i have a two types of jar actually guys understand if you are working with oracle 11g then you guys add add ojdbc 6 or ojdbc 5 but in my pc i am going to working with oracle 10g that's why i am going to adding here ojdbc 14 right so already i copied here my two jars in c drive and within the lib folder now i am going to adding this uh, uh, what jar file into my project then how to add so simply come to here our uh, our uh, eclipse id and here is my project folder simply right click on it simply right click on it and uh, here we have a one option that is called build path build path and once you select the build path here we have a option configure build path configure build path simply click on it guys and here uh, one dialog box will be uh, displayed and here go with libraries go with libraries simple in right side it all the options are disabled here actually 
and if you want to add any external jar simply click on class path okay once you click on class path some option will be appeared here now i am going to adding ojdbc 14 jar simply here click on add external jars right and automatically it will ask your path right and here my my jar jar folder uh, available in c drive in in c drive uh, we have a one folder that's what lib inside lib we have our ojdbc 14 jar simply click on it and uh, do open look at guys automatically our jar jar file is added right once you add jar file simply click on apply uh, again do apply and close don't forget Guys, understand previously we have a only two folders inside our JDBC applications. Now we got one more reference libraries, right? Simply extract this one. Now this folder is added, right guys? And like this, we are going to creating our first project folder to developing our JDBC application by using Eclipse IDE. And after creating, after creating JDBC project folder, Simply, we can add our JDBC, OJ, what OJDBC jar for our JDBC application folder. Right, guys? Thank you.